Marabunta, two players, the rematch. Mm. Fanny Rob over here versus JP. We won't tell you who won the first game, but we will put it up in the corner here. So if you want to watch that first, I suggest you do, because one of us will be trying to exact revenge ant style. This is a roll and write, but it's a I split, you choose type of game. And it's basically a war game involving ants. JP will be yeah. playing the blue. I will be playing red. You choose. Who would you like to go first? I think you go this time. All right. All right. What are we playing for here? Tile one. First one is the play by twice. Okay. I think that's how I'm going to divide this early on here. Seems equitable. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you want to use a three once, or would you like to use a one twice, or a zero twice, or a loot box twice? Let's go this side. Three. Gonna mark off the ant hill. Zero. box all right i will also mark off an ant hill i'm going to throw a zero down here mm -hmm. a one here i'm going to put a loot crate here and i will double a one okay all right, so you're rolling up. Next tile is, drum roll, scoring monkey. It's pretty early for that because right. you don't really know where you're dominating. I'm definitely putting all of my marbles here. This is mark off one of these scoring places, but you can only do it in two different ones. Don't like it. All right. Well, that is rough. Okay. Yeah. I'm choosing this one. Yeah. I'm going to put a two here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use my other ant hill to put a three here. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to cross off a loot crate here to put a one here. All right, we're doing the one here. We get the one yellow and the one blue, and then I can pick two, they cannot be the same. Right. I think we're going green. And one yeah. yellow, all in. All right, well. My roll? Your roll. This is a zero anywhere. Mm -hmm. Not needing to be not a to Follow the Ant Hill rules. A lot of zeros. A lot of zeros. Four zeros. <laughs> or a two, a loot, and a pink. Mm -hmm. Taking those. Might as well fill in that pink. Yeah. And then what is your loot box, sir? All right, so I can put a zero anywhere I want. Mm -hmm. Right? Zero anywhere. I'll put a zero here. Okay. And then you have three more zeros to put. They must be adjacent. Correct. One, two, three. That's rough. <laughs> you cornered me. Let's try that. Okay. This is two X's next to each other, and they don't have to be adjacent. They have to be adjacent to each other. They do not have to follow the adjacency rules. The adjacency rules to an ant hill. All right. So they, they must can... be next to each other. 
two lutes, a pink, a white, two X's, or mm -hmm. one three orange and a zero. Mm -hmm. All right, I think I'm taking this one. It's a lot of options. You still have that ant hill though. I do. All right, well, I might as well take the ones I have to. One, two. I'll go two crates here. And I'm gonna go two X's, one, two. Okay. I don't know. We're gonna go three there. And then one adjacent zero. Yeah. Let's go there, which is a cupcake. All right. I am up. What are we tiling for? A one adjacent. Adjacent. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's time to party. A lot of numbers to go. All right. You still haven't used that? Correct. All right. How do I want to play this? I'm going to go with this. I'm going to go with this side? Yeah. I'm going to go with the two here. We're going to do the other ant hill to do the... Three here, which means I'm not going to be able to use the pink. Um, so I'm going to do one here to get a crate, and I cannot use the pink. All right, two white and a three orange. Three orange, two white, and a crate. Okay. Now it's double crato. Lots of crates this time. Yep. Crate tastic. Is that your choice? That is my choice. So two crates, a pink and a blue, versus a three white, two crates, and a yellow. Okay. So we're gonna go two pink, two blue, mm -hmm. one crate, one, two, three. One crate. And that's me. Okay. Yellow. Three white. Oops. Oh, goodness. Sorry. Didn't wanna. And then two crates. One there and one. Okay. You made that choice? I split it, yes. All right, these are two zeros next to each other, but still must be adjacent to something else. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh my goodness. Yahtzee. Yahtzee indeed. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes. This is big. You're mm -hmm. out of ants. You can't really get to the blue easily, if at all. Mm -hmm. Orange is hotly contested. Current tie is scored. Current tie, that's correct. So we do that, we do that. We do that, we do that. That seems fair. 
I'm gonna go that way. Okay. I'm gonna take this side. I'm gonna do the crate here to do a zero. Mm. I'm gonna do the three here to get a crate. I'm gonna do the three here in green, the three there in white. Three, cupcake. Let's put two zeros next to each other. Mm -hmm. They must follow anthill adjacency. Mm -hmm. And be adjacent to each other. Zero. Zero. And then I get a pink three. Mm -hmm. Cupcake. Okay. I divide. Yes, now we're into the cupcakes for the rest of the game. It seems you have to cross off one of the cupcakes out here. We currently have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight remaining on the board. Keep in mind, the game also ends if one of the regions is filled. Mm -hmm. So let's see here. I'm taking that and I will get a... Say a one here. Mm -hmm. Crate here for two points. And one orange. Okay. We're gonna go. Oh, and you get to cross off a uh, cupcake. I'll get to cross off a cupcake. I get to cross off a cupcake. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're going to go one white, two green, and that. All right. My turn. Uh huh. Oh my gosh. Thank goodness for all the zeros. Zeros. That doesn't help me at all. Okay, I'll let you debate this. My choice has been made. Okay. For good or for bad, likely for bad. Oh boy. I think I'm gonna take this side. All right. Two zeros and a cupcake to be crossed. Oh wait, yeah, oh, yes, they don't have to be adjacent, sorry. So cross and cross, that's one cupcake point, and then cross out a cupcake. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I get a one green and a zero. Huh. Mm-hmm. My loot will come out. Here. Mm -hmm. And then you have a zero? Yes, a single zero. I think I will take it here mm -hmm. for that. Okay, one, two, three, four cupcakes remaining on the board. Good for you in that you can take a yellow and then get to a pink. Three green locks that up and you had to knock off a cupcake. I think I'm going here. Three. And a zero. I don't know. Okay. I think that was the right call. I probably should have moved the zero over as well. Because I really couldn't lose white. I don't think that any of the rest of it really 
makes a difference for us. I think that's right. I hope that's right, because otherwise I made a bad mistake, but... Two, two, let's say, doesn't really matter, three, and then I cannot use the orange. No. Correct, but uh, you must cross off a... A cupcake. Cupcake. And the options would be this one, this one, this one? Well, yes. We're going with that one then. All right, I don't blame you, but I had to take one. <laughs> yeah. All right, that was your choice, right? That was my choice. Gonna be this is gonna be rough. I can tell already this matters somewhat. How many cupcakes are left? This one and this one, is that it? Yep. Taking this sign. Okay. Oh boy. Don't know if it's good. I don't know either. I think that was a really tough split. Don't know if it's good. Um it's painful. Yeah, that's hard. Uh, I think you chose wisely. All right, so at least one cupcake left. Mm -hmm. I could end, no, I, yes, I could end the game. How so? Which one is, is this me? Oh, by putting the zero out. You, which one did you, you took? I this. took that one. Yeah. Okay, so I, yes, by putting this zero, yeah, I could end the game. I don't know if I want to end the game. Do you want to stay here and do the math? Four for you first. Three for me. You're up by one. Mm -hmm. Five for you. You're up by six. Eight for you. You're up by nine. Three for me, right? Mm -hmm. You're up by six. Two for me. You're up by four. Five. You're up by six. Two, th two for me puts you up by four. four. Which would be a tied score. And five. That'd be four points for me, which would be five to five on the board. Right, so we're totally tied at that point. You're exactly tied. And what is the, if we did the math correctly? What is the tie? What is the what is the uh, tiebreaker? Once you tie the total of the six regions, in the event of the tie, the player who has crossed off the most cupcakes. So that would be you, right? No, no, it would be I'm you. one ahead. So a tie is a me win. No, no, because the cupcakes, I would be crossing off this cupcake. It would it would tie. Oh, us with the box. So yeah. So what happens? <laughs> Oh no. Uh, Share the victory. Uh, nope. The player who triggers the end of the game would win. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. Alright, well then I have to try that. Yeah. If our math is correct, I believe it would be a tie. Okay. And a tie. So and, um, I put the crate here and a zero here, which triggers that. Oh, that actually gives me one point. Oh, then yeah. It won't I even be a tie. No. I think you're correct. All of that for nothing. All that for nothing. <laughs> Alright, but that's legit, right? Because that's a zero yes. anywhere. And then I get the two aren't is all, all the rest of this really doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I don't think any of the others two, change anything. Two. Two. Mm-hmm. Game over? Is that all of that the is, cupcakes? I believe that is correct. All right, so let's try it again. Do the math one more time. That's all right, so four. here you get four. Here I get three. Mm-hmm. Here you get five. Here you get three. Here that's eight to seven. Mm -hmm. I get three. And here it's a you get two. Creaming. I get two. Fourteen. Thirteen. Two. Yeah. Holy smokes, ball game. That was it. That is Marabunta. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm. Please like this video, subscribe to the channel. Thank you, Dr. Knizia. This is a really fun game.